Hi guys, I'm Mr. Virtual. Today in this lesson, we will talk about Quebec's physiographic regions. What does the word physiographic mean? This word is divided into two. Physio, which means nature in Greek, and graphic, like something that is drawn on a map. So, let's talk about the three big physiographic regions we find in Quebec. The first region is the Appalachians, located in the south of the province, stretching from the Gaspé area to the United States, over 1,400 kilometers. I love to ski. Maybe you have been to Mont Orford or Sutton Resorts before, or have gone for long walks on Mont Albert. These are all part of the Appalachians. These mountains have been there for a while, 450 million years, in fact. The second region is the Canadian Shield. No, not that kind of shield. The Canadian Shield is a huge rocky plateau filled with lakes and rivers. That is why hydroelectric dams are often built in the area, such as the Manic Dam. Did you know that there is another chain of mountains near Montreal where you can ski? The Laurentians. Maybe you have gone to Mont Tremblant or Mont Saint-Anne near Quebec City. Even if they are 300 kilometers apart, the two hills are still part of the same chain, the Laurentians. The third region is the St. Lawrence Lowlands. If you want carrots and bees, that is the place to go. It's a perfect place for farming, growing fruits, and raising cattle. Our ancestors worked very hard to clear all that land under the seigneurial system. You will find all sorts of trees in the St. Lawrence Lowlands. The evergreen, such as spruce and fir, but also deciduous trees. Deciduous trees lose their leaves in the fall. And there is a third chain of mountains here. Did you ever go pick apples on Mont Rougemont or walk on Mont Saint Hilaire? Believe it or not, this is yet another chain, the Monteregian Hills. Now you can go and click on the next four elements, taking time to read all the information. Once you have read the information, you will be able to answer the questions on the quiz. The quiz will help you see what you have learned. You should get at least 80% on the quiz before moving on to the next lesson. You can redo the quiz as many times as necessary. Good luck! When you are done, come and meet me at the next lesson by clicking home. Then, Grade 6, Quebec, Lesson 2, Population of Quebec in 1905. See you at the next lesson.